are stained with blood. What's up, YouTube? D Block, the retro video game toy hunter, coming at you with a new series of videos I'm going to be doing called Midnight Movie Trash. Basically, these videos are going to be VHS, Blu ray, DVD. Um, horror movies. Um, I do collect VHS tapes and I do also resell a lot of VHS tapes. Um, it's going to be pickups, uh, reviews, um, you know, list of my favorite slashers. You know, it's going to be movie more movie related than toys, and well, there will be horror related themes. Like, um, I've shown the 8-bit, uh, Jason figure. Um, this would be something also that I'm really into. Uh, laser discs, um, CDs, all that kind of stuff that I pick up at flea markets, yard sales, thrift shops, um, your retail stores, Amazon, all that good stuff. Well, let's get into the first, um, VHS pickups. I've shown these before in a, in one of my retro pickups, but I did find a sealed copy of Carrie and a factory sealed Return of Salem, Salem's Lot. I thought it's always cool to find factory sealed um, tapes, not resealed like from blockbusters and whatnot. Also, I did find. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Sledgehammer. I've never seen this before. Picked it up because uh, the Salvation Army by my house that's going on business had a deal. You picked any three VHS tapes and you would get them for a buck. Um, also, that trip, I got The Invincible Man. And it is not a DVD, but she count a VHS. She counted it as a VHS tape, Volume Two of SCTV. Basically, it's a bunch of classic um, shows, whatnot. You know, for coming out to thirty three cents, something like that. Amazon resells this for twenty five bucks used. So this is basically a recouper to fund more pickups and the uh, last time I went I did find Red Sonia and the first Punisher movie that's all the VHS I did find there at the Salvation Army that's going out of business for um, they're usually $2.99 the DVDs but the Lady gave them to me half off. Um, Argento's Cat of Nine Tails. And Name for Evil. I mean, they're Diamond Entertainment, you know, cheesy budget titles. But they look cool. I said, why not? And I did pick up a Blu ray of San Andreas. She picked this up for my mom as a gift. She's a big fan of The Rock. And right after Christmas, I went back to Heroes and Fantasies, where I picked up my other Jason. And I picked up Jason Lives Part 6 action figure and whatnot. I'm a big Jason fan. So to add this to the collection, I said, yeah, I was going to get the Leatherface, the Atari 8-bit one. But it... I mean, it was okay, but it was just too green and too plain. I said, nah, I'd rather get Jason. So, these were $24.99. And I had a couple of, of, they did a promotion during the holidays. If you purchased, and for every $10, they gave you a dollar of hero cash. So, I had a few a few bucks that I used. So, it, it came it came out to just under 20 something about 20 bucks. But... That's all for this first uh, Midnight Movie Trash. I'm going to put
put a list of my favorite slashers and all that good stuff. Um, just something else to the channel that I'm really into. And instead of making a different channel for it, might as well combine it, being that a lot of VHS later discs considered retro. So let me know if you have any suggestions for this segment, any kind of reviews or any kind of list you would like to see. Um, like, comment, subscribe, that's all.